that was intense. That was the ending. I don't think I was prepared for the ending for it to end that way. But I guess I shouldn't be surprised because they are a rock band. They're not here to make Disney endings and Disney movies. So... <laughs> What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. This is video f number 59. As always, we start with gratitude. So thank you to everyone that's watching, sharing, liking, commenting, and subscribing. I really appreciate you guys. Still though, 80% of the people that watch these videos do not subscribe. So if you're one of those people you're watching right now, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Show your boy some love. That would be amazing. Special shout out to everyone that supports my Patreon and Amazon wish list. Thank you guys so much. If you would like to support the channel, help it grow faster, you can hit one of the links in my description. All right, guys. Um, today, I'm going to be reacting to a new band, um, Guns N' Roses. As you guys know, I've been going through my list, trying to do these two-a-days, um, trying to get all these recommendations out the way that you guys have been sending me. So Guns N' Roses is next up on the list. Um, the song is called November Rain. I've never heard of it before, never heard of them before, but I like their name and I like the song title as well. So um, we're going to check it out and see what this one is about. There we go. I like when they incorporate all these instruments. That's just like my favorite thing about these reactions. The build up though. When I look into your eyes, I can see love restraint. Darling, when I hold you, don't you know I feel the same? This is dope. These lyrics right now are just next level. Wow. I mean, it sounds like poetry. You know, darling, when I look into your eyes, I can see the love is strange. But don't you know when I hold you, I can feel the same. Um, hearts can change and you can't hold a candle in cold November rain. That's just so inspiring. And that resonates so much with me because I don't know if a lot of you guys know, but I love poetry. I actually write poetry. Um, I have an Instagram page dedicated to some poems that I wrote. Maybe I'll put it at the end of the video. But these lyrics are just inspiring me to go write some stuff right now. So top-notch lyricism right now. That's crazy.
I love this. That's just crazy. This is just amazing right now. Like I said before, the lyricism of it all is just impeccable. This is just masters at writing. I don't know if they wrote the song themselves, but in terms of just the writing, this is what is standing out to me because I just love these lyrics right now. This is just crazy. And I'm going to go more in depth in the lyrics at the end of the video, but I just wanted to point that out. Again, exceptional, exceptional stuff.
different. Wow, guys, that was incredible. Jesus. All right, guys, so that was my reaction to Guns N' Roses' November Rain. That was intense. That was the ending. I don't think I was prepared for the ending, for it to end that way. But I guess I shouldn't be surprised because they are a rock band. They're not here to make Disney endings and Disney movies. So, but let's talk about the video. So it starts off. Um, I pulled up the lyrics because they're so just intense. Like, uh, basically, he's talking about when he looks into her eyes, he can see the restraint, and when he holds her. Um, doesn't she feel the same? So I guess basically he's he's starting a story where he's showing like her hesitancy to love him back um, at the start of their relationship. And then it progresses to a point where she does love him back and they're getting married and stuff like that. And at this point of the story, I'm thinking, okay, this is going to be a happily ever after situation. But the story progresses to a point where she ends up dying um, and leaves him alone. So it's like these transition from her hesitancy to love him to them getting married to her dying and leaving him and him standing by her graveside at the end of it. And then the rain pours again, synonymous with the title, the rain falls and washes out the whole funeral the same way it washed out the wedding. So that's like a consistent theme all the way through. Um, so yeah, it's just incredible storytelling. That was easy to follow. The solo that was going on when he stood on top of the piano and as well as in the music video because they incorporated the music video with their live performance. That was just incredible to watch. Like he absolutely killed that. Whoever the guitarist is did an amazing job. The singer as well, his voice I feel like was just perfect for this song because you can hear a certain amount of pain in his voice when he's singing. Um, it's kind of raspy as well, but I feel like it just fitted perfectly for this song. Um, it's so many nuances that was happening here, guys. I don't even know if I'm breaking down everything or I'm remembering everything because there was just so many things to decipher. But I loved it in terms of, like I said, the lyricism. Um, it just spoke to me. It's incredible, incredible writing. So Guns N' Roses, you guys definitely made an impression on me. November Rain, I really enjoyed that one. I definitely want to react to more stuff because if the writing is like that, I feel like I'm going to enjoy all of their songs. Um, and I look forward to reacting to more of their stuff. So please, guys, if you're Guns N' Roses fans, you know a lot of their songs, um, especially songs with just beautiful storytelling, beautiful lyrics like this. Let me know. I will check them out. I will react to them. Um, so thank you guys so much for rocking with me on this reaction. If you liked it, if you like my breakdown, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as hit one of the links in my description to support the channel. And as always, thank you guys for rocking with me. Until next time, peace.